hello friends dear uh, chair here i'm going to make a video about how to set up multiple monitor in euro truck simulator and american truck simulator in a very simple way first when i got two monitors i tried to put that in multiple monitor and i got so many solutions like uh, they are what is it they are little tough there is an easy, easiest way to put that in so i will show you all you have to download a dll file i'll put that in my link i'll put the link in my description and i will show you how to do that you see this is the dll file which you have to copy uh, and uh, what i'm gonna do is to copy this dll to my game directory all you have to copy this to your american truck simulator pin windows 86 that means the 32 bit of the of the games and just copy the dll to here okay that's all that's all you have to do then start your grain start the game it's your actual screen go to options and it's not zooming wait, wait, wait. go to graphics see you will see this the, you see my default graphic resolution is 1366 into 768 when i connect two monitors it will automatically come up to 2390 into 768 so what i have to do just put that in and click the apply button wait for a second and you can see soft th okay yes that's all you have to do that's only and very simplest way which i have found and sharing with you i will give you the link for that dll file in my description i will also upload it to my google drive even the link is not working you can download it my from my google drive and uh, like uh, my next video will be playing with this your know, american truck simulator with my homemade gaming wheel i will tell you I'll just play it on and here now I will tell you some details. It's see it's an it's an old ball type mouse. I think it's little difficult to find these days and I have mounted to this a small screwdriver. There is a small screwdriver sorry there is a nut to an axle actually this part this part is comes inside the hard disk it's a hard hard disk reader head so it work like a, as a ball bearing and it's much cheaper to have this than buy a ball bearing you, you go to your nearest computer shop and ask them please provide a dead hard disk they will give you for free i got uh, two three of them i have ripped it i work in the computer field so i know this this can help me so i have mounted it to a nut and port and i have connected it so the weight of the wheel will not come to this this mouse i have screwed it here i have screwed the mouse to this base and i have somehow adjusted this optical encoder and the circuit and i have connected it via ps2 so it's it's better to play when it's, it's better that we play it with multiple monitors you don't know how to move the mouse around to look what is coming what's seen you can use the number part for that and it's a much easier way and i have once i have uploaded this uh, some photos of some photos of this 
my pedal setup my pedal setup actually i have put a space here for my clutch which will be coming soon so i mean i'm making that like i said I, I see and i and there is a multi turn potentiometer you can see here i have i have mounted it you can see there is a multi turn potentiometer here i have mounted this you can see so i'll be making a gaming wheel with arduino arduino uno 3 so this is a 5 turn 10k potentiometer but it's not you see it's it's not working perfectly fine not the potentiometer the gaming wheel actually i got 900 900 degree uh, wheel rotation but uh, there is some point like uh, in center i have to rotate it one then it will it will recognize by this uh, game so i have to reconfigure it again when i play it with 180 degree potentiometers it's working perfectly fine so i am to the next step to make a gaming rig with sorry gaming wheel with uh, arduino with so many patterns and some adjustments i am also planning to use the 180 degree port with uh, with the gearing system like uh, two gears one is small one is big and one is to five it will be the ratio so uh, it will help me out i think i will update you soon guys thank you for watching have a great new year have fun spread love what to say saying stay in peace calm thank you